Hi everyone, my name is Lucia and I'm currently a first year physical therapy student at Western University. Today I'm going to share some insight into our program and this is relevant for the 2021 to 2022 school year. So let's just get started on the five pros. First of all, I like that our program has a reasonable course load and that they put an effort most of the time in spacing out the evaluations as well as labs and lectures. So for example, if, if it's Monday and we have a written exam coming up on Friday, a lot of the times I notice that the amount of lab hours we have would significantly decrease to give us more time to study during that week. And then once our written exam on the Friday is over, uh, we would have more labs the next week to kind of make up for the decreased amount of labs the previous week. So I like that. And just on average, we usually would have around like four to six hours of class and labs per day. And honestly, I don't think it's that bad. We still have time to live our lives. We still do have times where it is busy, but just the overall trend I get is that it's pretty reasonable and I'm having an okay time. Another pro that I would like to highlight would be our warm and friendly environment that we have here. So all the profs are really supportive and understanding. Our students are all really nice and really friendly with each other. And I think that comes from us having a lot of opportunities to work with each other through our changing learning teams, as well as getting to know each other outside of the classroom through social events and also intramural teams. Uh, for our third pro, um, if you've done research on Western's program, I'm sure it's come up that Western is strong in orthopedics. And I would agree with that because we have case-based learning for our clinics courses and our instructors are really great at walking us through the clinical reasoning of these cases, as well as giving us insight from their years of experience. Now, speaking of case-based learning, I think Western has a good mixture between the case-based and the didactics learning, and didactics is just lecture-based learning. I have to say, case-based learning is extremely time-consuming, and personally, I don't think I would like it if every course was like that. It would just be way too much for me. I think Western has a really good balance between the two, um, but that depends on what your learning style is as well. My final pro is that our placements are later on into the program compared to other universities. And I think it's a good thing to have our placements start later because it gives us more time to build knowledge and have more information to refer to once the placements do start. But again, this is also a personal preference thing. Now onto the cons. There are times where I would say the program is a little bit disorganized. And this is just occasionally. I wouldn't say it really strongly affects my experience. To give an example, there were some discrepancies in some of the details that the profs were teaching, as well as in the marking for the practical exams. They say, we should just focus on the skills, not the marks. And also as long as we, basically as long as we don't fail, it's fine. It's just sometimes a bit frustrating. The next con is that our first semester is very much theory based and it almost felt like I was still in undergrad kinesiology. And I think the intention behind this is to make sure that we all have the same foundational knowledge and to help us with the transition from undergrad. But I've talked to some of my classmates and some people felt that the amount of knowledge was just overwhelming and they would have liked a bit more application-based information. Another con is that sometimes the speed of implementing change is a little bit slow. So we do have town hall meetings throughout the year to get feedback from the students and have a dialogue between the faculty members and the students but i did hear that this is mainly for collecting info to make changes for next year's class while i do understand that you know some things in the curriculum are set in stone and you can't just suddenly pivot but it would be so nice to know that you know, our feedback can be implemented into our class and not just for the next class the fourth con is about placements so we have less placements. In total, we have four placements and they are seven to eight weeks each. I think it would be greater to have more variety and have one extra connection rather than like a longer time period in each placement. But our placements haven't really started yet. So who knows when it starts, perhaps I will appreciate additional time, but I guess we'll have to see for that one. And finally, the fifth con is about our PT building. Elborn College. Elborn College is just a confusing building. I don't understand who came up with this layout. Yeah, like I'm fine now. I don't get lost. Like 
all the time, but I would just say I get, it takes a bit of time to get used to. Despite these cons, I'm overall happy with my experience and I'm really grateful to be part of the Western Physiotherapy Program. I hope this helps with your PT school decisions or gives you an idea of what to expect if you're planning to come here next year. If it did, please like this video and subscribe to see more of my videos. Thank you so much and see you next time.